Hello. Uh, my name is Jen, and you were in my refrigerator. She has the kind of social media footprint influencers crave. What's that? Who knows? Yet somehow, Ashboro's Jen Hamilton has managed to garner more than a million followers on TikTok by posting the not so glamorous. Because I keep cleaning my house and expecting it to stay that way. Mundane. Hey, I'm Jen with your Amazon Prime order. What? And downright exhausting side of motherhood. I have felt that sense of guilt if I'm not able to be that perfect Instagram mom. And so if no one else was going to show how it really is, I was going to show it. Jen's vulnerabilities are on full display. And perhaps that's why she couldn't help but notice a post in a mom group from a woman who could no longer shy away from hers. She said that she had a young baby and another child. She was um, suffering from postpartum depression. And her house had gotten to the point where she was so overwhelmed to even start on the dishes, the laundry, the organizing, that she just felt paralyzed. That mom wanted recommendations for cleaning companies despite mentioning she couldn't afford it. Jen jumped on a reply. I made a separate post in that group saying, would there be anyone willing to come with me? Like, let's find out who this girl is and let's go rescue her. Let's just dig her out from her funk because we've all been there. It was a yes for Brittany Tran. I just thought that was a need that was not being met. I mean, I felt like instant connection to that because I don't have family in the area. Kim Wicker was in too. Being a mom is overwhelming, but also during this time that we're in. And so when that mom made that post, I really felt that. Jen, Brittany, Kim, and about five others banded together. We carpooled to her house and we not kicked her out, but we lovingly said, go have a great day. We've got it from here. And clean the place from top to bottom. I don't think anyone walked into that house and said, oh, I think we all walked in and said, you have kids. Seeing the relief on her face. She could just walk in and take a breath and, you know, enjoy being in her home again. They knew they couldn't stop there. Last night, I got a stomach bug, so I was not able to go. But I just want to share with you the video that she just sent me. So don't mind me because I just got home from the hospital. But I just wanted to thank you guys so much, Jen. Coming home and not having to worry about everything being crazy. We just said, if you have anybody in your life or if you are that somebody who needs help, nominate yourself or someone else. Months later, Jen, Brittany, Kim, and volunteers across the Piedmont are still giving moms a break from the needs of the house. The mission at the core of this posse of parents known as Hot Mess Express. Hi, I'm Jennifer and we are Hot Mess Express, San Francisco, East Bay, California. Hot Mess Express. We are going to be the Chicago South and Western. Since Jen started Hot Mess Express, there are now over 186 chapters across the United States. It's more than just going in and cleaning a house. I feel like we're providing this community of moms, friends. Moms lack friends. A sisterhood. We all get it. We just, we know how it is and we know how things can kind of pile up. Reminding each other that it's okay to reach out for help. But we all have our own struggles. We all have our own messes and it's okay to not be okay. And it's okay to ask for help. And that's what we're here for. Judgment free.